mid 50s at noon. We're close to 60 this afternoon, much less breezy. We get a gap in the middle part of the day. Here's that rain and it will taper off back to the west a little bit, but you see it just kind of blossoming all the way back through central Missouri. So going to be with us for a while. The model has the morning rain going out and then kind of a gap through the middle part of the day. This is noon as we get toward the evening commute rain moving back in, but right now it's a fairly steady line. So unless this breaks up, the chance for showers lingers for much of the day, but does intensify a little bit as we get toward late evening. This is 11 o'clock, so a wave of rain here and in the early overnight we may get a few rumbles of thunder early in the morning and then look at this uh, it tapers off again tomorrow morning, a little heavier down to our south, but could easily have wet roads for tomorrow's commute and maybe for Friday's as well. That's the kind of week it's going to be increasing chances for thunderstorms each of the next few days too. We're back in the mid 60s, very mild in the morning with upper 40s to mid 50s. I think the chance for severe weather starts to go up as we head toward the end of the week as well, especially for Friday as a stronger cold front moves in Saturday. We're back in the upper 40s. It brightens up high pressure returns for the weekend. We're in the mid 50s for Sunday. Monday brings another chance for showers with a high in the mid 50s. Notice our morning lows settling back into the 30s and then Tuesday mid 50s. It stays mostly cloudy. So overall, not looking too bad here next couple of days uh, in temperature wise, but rain is going to be a problem.